So guys, if you have this issue, the motor won't turn, so jammed in. Uh, the fix, easy fix, is to install the original plate here, which comes with the telescope, uh, and then install the other plate on the top of it. And the screws are fortunately uh, long enough uh, that comes with this uh, telescope that can accommodate both plates together, the original screws. So this is what fixed. I tried everything. I upgraded, updated firmware of the handheld. I updated firmware of the motor, which did not need it. I tried as well anyways with the firmware update. The motor had uh, so now it's going backwards. So yeah, this fixed the issue and motor started to uh, turn. Before it wasn't turning, I tried everything, everything possible. I'm so happy and this fix uh, actually solved my problem of motor jammed and won't, won't turn so yeah install the original orange plate that comes with the telescope and then install the, the one that comes with the motor on the top of it same screws can be utilized so it is about to uh, finish it has been about 60 seconds First it turned all the way to right, now it's turning all the way to left and we are waiting. I think it's finished. It's turning back to the other side. I think it's going to go and stop in the middle before saying successful. This is where we're really first time I'm calibrating this motor, really first time. So I don't know what the next pop-up window will be. But yeah, this fix seems to be working. Uh, Installing the original plate first that comes with the telescope, especially for uh, SE series. Complete. Yay! That's the message, that's the screen we want to see. And the motor has stopped. And so it seems to be, everything seems to be perfectly working and calibrated. So install the... Uh, like a broken record install the original plate back we actually never needed to take it out so the cause seems to be when we're taking out the original plate and putting only this plate that comes with the motor is uh, putting some pressure on the bearing focuser bearing and it won't turn so basically when you get this motor just don't take out anything from the telescope Mine happens to be 8SE, but it's all SE series would be same. Also age, I think, if you have same problem. So the pressure is on the bearing, so don't take out anything from the telescope, leave it as is. And then just install the plate that comes with the motor on the top of it. And this fixed my issue, and I'm happy. Clear skies.